In this video of Tableau do-it-yourself tutorial, more on calculations. We're going to talk about some calculations on this BDCS claims TW file, the database which we just used. Now drag and drop the claim date field on the column shale, shelf and change the green to month. So claim date I'm going to create a new one and make it 31 claim date to the column shelf and change it to month so create a calculation count of claim ID make we'll, we'll, we'll see if it looks right so right click create calculated field count of claim ID and just say count of claim ID please remember this that this database is an extension of claims subset which we had in the previous video so I'm gonna drag and drop the count of claim and I'm gonna make it as text so so February and March we have this many counts okay so let's see I'm gonna drop claim ID here but there are not many claim IDs there are only C1 C2 these are the claims and remember the claim ID and claim item there you go so the problem is that it's calculating each and every line we don't want to do that so as in the previous examples we will create count of distinct claim ID so we'll do count of distinct claim ID and here we will see count distinct claim ID oops and I'm gonna say count D please remember that if you do not have an extract the count D expression would not be available for your calculation so make sure the calculation is valid click on OK and I'm gonna drop this and you can see the difference So this is the actual 6 is your count of distinct. Let me put it here so that you can see it more clearly. There you go. So count of distinct claim IDs is 6 for February and 4 for March. But these are the number of lines. Alright, let's make it one more calculation and we are going to do running average of distinct claims per day running average of distinct claims per day so first of all I'm gonna make it look good I'm gonna remove measure names I'm gonna remove this and I'm gonna have count of distinct claim only distinct claim for February and March and now I'm gonna do a running average right click calculated parameters running average claims and I'm gonna do running average of the count of distinct claims make sure the calculation is valid and now I'm gonna drag and drop over here you can see that the running average and the count of distinct claims are a bit different. Let's make it dual axis. There you go. So count of distinct claims is this blue and running average of claims is this orange lines. To make this visualization more active, 
I'm going to drag and drop the country in the filter area and click on show filter so country in the filter area select all and click on show filter and I can select this to drop down single value drop down and you can see for each country the the running average and the count of distinct claims so time for some hands-on exercises so these exercises would help you to gain more insights exercise number 47 says create a new tableau workbook drag and drop claim date field on the column shell change the green to day and calculate the number of claims item per day items per day not claim ID this is line next is create a new tableau worksheet do not create workbook I meant worksheet and drag and drop claim date change the granularity to dates and calculate the number of claims per day using the level of detail calculations please refer my earlier video on level of detail and do this calculations next calculation is to do a level of detail calculations on claim amounts per day so these things is gonna are gonna help you to understand calculations in detail thank you for watching